Welcome to our F-Sharp exploration video. Today, we're tackling an intriguing question from one of our viewers. When were F-Sharp unused reserved keywords removed from the specs? This question highlights an important aspect of the F-Sharp language evolution. Our viewer mentions reading about the removal of certain unused reserved keywords, like params, and the shift towards using attributes instead. However, they couldn't find these removed keywords on the official keyword reference page. Let's dive into this topic and clarify where you can find the information you need. Welcome back to another tech video. Today, we're gonna to be going through your question, answering it, and hopefully finding that solution for you. Guys, remember to stay a little bit crazy like me and find that resolution. Now, let's continue on. In f -shar, some reserved keywords that were previously unused have been removed from the specifications. One example is the keyword params. To find information about these changes, you can refer to the official f -sharp documentation. However, the keyword reference page may not list all removed keywords. For a comprehensive list of changes, including removed keywords, you can check the f -sharp GitHub repository. Look for the release notes or change log. Additionally, community forums and discussions can provide insights into these changes and how to adapt your code accordingly. Let's now look at a user-suggested answer. f -sharp removed several unused reserved keywords in version 4.1. You can find more details in the RFC on GitHub. The keywords removed include method, constructor, and atomic. The community prefers using member and new instead. Other keywords like eager, object, and recursive were also deemed unnecessary with alternatives available. Finally, functor, measure, and volatile were removed as they have sufficient alternatives in the language. And that's it guys. I hope that's found the answer that you were looking for and you got through to that solution. If you did, please hit the subscribe button. I'd really appreciate it. And until the next time, you have a technical issue, I'll see ya. Have a good one.